What's up cooks, it's Wednesday. So we went out on a camping trip this last week and I had the opportunity to use the Coleman Even Temp stove. We had did a BTU test on a few of these Coleman stoves and I wanted to take this stove out and give it a first run. I had some really great experience with this stove and um, also a little bit of challenge. So what's up, it's Wednesday and let's talk about this Even Temp by Coleman. So, you know the first thing I had to cook was breakfast. When I'm out at the campsite, nothing's better than cooking breakfast outdoors. So I sauteed up some sausage first. The Even Temp did a great job. And I can tell you with the electronic start, it is absolutely fantastic. I love the electronic um, start on that. So next I sauteed up some onion. I took the sausage out and then sauteed up some onion. And I put eggs and tomatoes on top. It was absolutely fantastic. The Even Temp did a great job. It was slightly breezy and um, I didn't have any problem with the flame going out at all. And um, I give it my thumbs up. So it was late that first night when we arrived. So I wanted to cook something really easy. So I popped two pans on the Even Temp, dropped some butter in there, and I started cooking just some packaged rice. I was going to make grilled chicken, some grilled vegetables, and some rice. And when you're out on the, um, you know, camping, you want something easy. So I got a package of rice with some butter. I actually did two packages of this. And um, we cooked this up just according to the package directions. Great thing that it shows is how the even temp can control a simmer on this. So I started off just by sauteing the rice. I popped in some water and um, I also I actually used like uh, five cups of water. So I just used two and a half bottles of water in there. And then I put, and then I put in the seasoning packet. So I covered it and let the stove uh, bring the pot to a boil. So I added a little light olive oil in here and I added some onion. I'm just gonna saute some onion and zucchini, season it up for a quick side dish. I absolutely love sauteed zucchini. You can add whatever vegetables you like. Um, when we got to a rapid boil, I reduced the, the temperature of the rice and I added in the zucchini. Then I seasoned it up. Salt, pepper, and a little bit of Mrs. Dash. And then I cooked it till it was crisp tender. Okay, we bought some pre-marinated chicken. And when I open up the package, they're really small pieces. <laughs> so we're just gonna go for it. And I think this is some kind of lemon chicken. So we got our grill fired. I'm gonna put the chicken on here. Should be pretty good anyway. Eric, my grill master. Some of these slices are pretty thin. We're going to hold off for a few minutes before we put these little guys on because they just might burn up before the other ones are done burning. So, okay. We'll, we'll be back in a few. So, we served up our plates. Let me tell you, this was not a gourmet meal by any stretch of the imagination, but it was absolutely fantastic because we were tired. And um, we had pulled up to the campsite and uh, it was hot and humid and, you know, it was kind of miserable. But the Even Temp did a great job. One of the things I can say is, 
You know, I sort of have this issue with my RV stove in the previous um, Coleman's that I've had, that I've had to use really thin pans on them because they really couldn't drive a heavy, heavy, thick pan. Um, one thing about the even temp is it um, really drove these thin pans and at times I had difficulty, you know, getting a simmer on the rice um, because these pans are really thin and they take up the heat really fast. So I really think the even temp could do a great job with thicker pans, even like cast iron and even like tri-ply. Um, the really thin pans, I really think that it has a little bit too much power for and I couldn't get a simmer on them. Um, that's, you know, my main, you know, issue with it just was, um, it seemed like it was a little difficult for me to control the heat. So I really think with an even temp, you need some decent quality cookware with it. So you can really um, have a more enjoyable experience. As you can see, we kind of gave a little too much fire to our chicken on the grill, but you know, it was great. We had a great time and we sat back and had some delicious food and some great conversation. And um, I really would give the even tent my thumbs up because I love the um, start on it. And um, I think it did a great job and I think it will do great with cast iron and my, um, my tri-ply cookware. So my opinion of the even tent is it's a thumbs up. So Campin' Cooks, what's up? It's Wednesday. I hope you had a great weekend. We had fun on our camping trip. I am absolutely exhausted. I came home to piles of camping equipment all over my house and laundry, and I'm just trying to get caught up with that. Um, I hope that you enjoyed this little um, first look at the Coleman um, even temp we are going to have a few more videos up about our camping trip including our huge water fight so looking forward to that um, if you like this video please subscribe below leave me a comment and a like and also visit my brand new website amylearnstocook.com I'm also on social media at Pinterest and Twitter at amylearnstocook on Instagram I'm at cooking with Amy and Facebook, come on over and join the conversation. Facebook, Facebook.com slash groups slash Amy Learns to Cook. And um, happy Wednesday. I hope you had a great one. And um, keep cooking.